Welcome to Wally's TV Repair. Here is an LG 42 inch model number 42 LC7D. The power is not coming on, no screen. When you plug it in, there's a red light, the LED. When you go to turn it on, it blinks green about 15 times. and then does nothing. So what we're going to do is to remove the back of the TV and look at the power supply. Okay, with the back removed, about 16 screws around the edge. With the back removed, the power supply board is the one to the left with the large capacitors on it. The bottom is where the power comes in. This is where the power goes out to the logic board. This is the high voltage over on the left hand side. Horizontal and vertical drivers to the upper left. And then this is the power supply. You will notice several of the capacitors have a TP top, the pointed top on them. Those are most likely blown capacitors. So we're going to replace those capacitors today and see if it fixes it. Okay, here are the capacitors needed for the repair. They didn't have 2200 microfarad, so I got 2700 microfarad at 16 volt and 1500 microfarad at 35 volt. Typically it's okay to go up on the capacitor rating, but not down. Since this is a DC voltage power supply, the larger capacitor should be okay. We'll install them and see if it's going to work. Okay, I uh, highlighted each of the capacitors to be removed with a yellow highlight marker. As you can see, they're in yellow slightly. Um, also, note the polarity of the capacitors as you reinstall them. The negative is on the curved side of the capacitor symbol, so make sure you put them in correctly. And then also on your soldering iron, make sure your soldering iron has a nice, bright, shiny tip. I clean this with steel wool. I will use desoldering braid to remove the solder around each of the components. Okay, all the capacitors have been removed. This is the last one to install. You can see the leads there off of the board and just clip the leads back close to the surface. Again, one thing to note is the polarity. Make sure the polarity goes in correctly with the negative on the, on the correct side. The short lead on the capacitor is typically the negative. So you just clip this lead back, if I can do this, on both of them. And then we'll put it back in the TV and see what happens. Okay, here's the power supply board reinstalled. And here is the moment of truth. There's a raster. That's a good sign. And there's Dr. Oz. <laughs> How appropriate. Now we just need to return the cover to the back of the unit and place it back into service. I hope this video helps you. If you have any questions, reply in the comment field. Thanks.